<sighs> hopefully, hopefully everything uh, works out. We'll, we'll have to just wait and see. I guess we'll go ahead and just unpause it for right now. Yeah, I guess we'll I guess we'll leave it like that. <coughs> Excuse me. We'll begin to start in just a little while, everybody. We'll begin to start in around the three, maybe four minute mark. So until that time, as per usual, you know, get ourselves prepared and um, yeah, get the stream started real soon. Yeah, again, hopefully everything goes well and uh, yeah, I can be able to. You know, play, play play this and stuff today. But I'm 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 curious to see how things play out. This is pretty much new to me. But uh, I'll try and uh, explain everything in due time. <coughs> I guess we'll uh, see how long it takes three moments to do its thing. Sometimes it can be pretty early, sometimes it can be kind of late, so... Hopefully, hopefully a chat, hopefully a chat box, you know, doesn't give me any issues for, for whatever reason today. Okay, there's stream elements, so... Notifications should possibly be going out. Although, I don't always know if, like, you know, whenever stream elements, uh... You know, does its thing. If like that's the sign, if that's a sign that like um, you know, that it's sending out notifications to everyone saying, hey, you know, I'm live, so you know, come on by. But we'll see. If I don't get, if no one, if no one shows up when the four minute mark hits, then I'll uh, I'll I'll do my intro and stuff regardless. So yeah. Which I have a feeling, which I have a feeling, it's probably going to be the case since no one's here for right now. <coughs> yeah, hopefully everything goes well, and uh, you know, um, this this thing, you know, plays ball, plays ball well, and all that, all that, all that good stuff. I think it's been a, I think it's been a while since I last done a stream of something on an emulator, would it be like a uh, well, I think I think as far as like SNES type stuff. I mean, not counting the um, not not counting like the jet like the Sega like the Sega stuff, you know, from like Genesis stuff to uh, Mega Drive or Master System, or whatever. I can't, I can't, I can't honestly remember the last time I, uh, I did a thing with, um, uh, SNES, which I think was, it was quite a while back, I think the last time I was trying to do something was possibly a, uh, a randomizer hack or something like that, I, I can't remember, but yeah. <sighs> Alright, it is now past the four minute mark. And since Stream Elements has done its thing, I'll do my thing, which is my intro. So, hey yo, my fellow Rumble Maniacs, it's Mr. Rumble Roses here. And welcome to a special installment of Super Mario World ROM Hacks. Today we're going to be trying out a ROM hack called Super Mario World Christmas Edition. <coughs> Excuse me. Um. Now, this was something that, that, this was a ROM hack that I've had in my uh, SNES ROM folder dictionary thing for quite a while, but I've never really done much of it, but, but I've never really played much of it, if at all, really, and I figured that, um, I figured that since Christmas time is getting closer and closer, that I would try and do a, uh, a ROM, I, I have like at least two ROM hacks of Mario World that has 
like a Christmas theme going on for it, and I figured I had to give this one a shot. So I don't I don't know how I don't know how long this hack is because I didn't I didn't really look at any info info about it, especially because I have I've had it for a while and any information that I did have probably would just go out the window because I don't because it's been so long. But um, from what I can, from what from what I can understand at the very least, like. It's gonna have like a new little story and um, some levels to play around with as well and stuff. So you know that's that's a, that's a thing. I don't know if there's any. I don't know if there's gonna be any new music because I think so far it's just mostly uh, Mario classic Mario World uh, music. But I mean, something better than nothing, you know. But, uh, yeah, I figured that for my slow week, I would give a, um, <coughs> a Mario World hack a try, and because of how it was getting close to Christmas, I figured I'd try this Christmas edition hack, so, hopefully everything goes well, and, uh, you know, maybe we'll make some progress on it or something, so, yeah, but right now I'm gonna go ahead and unpause it, and, you know, see how things play out. Go to Mario A, the one player. Welcome, it's Christmas, but an evil ice princess wants to steal your presents. Hurry up, your friends are waiting for you. So maybe we might have a new enemy? Or a new boss? Oh, sorry, it's too cold for me, and I cannot help you this time, Yoshi. Snowfield. I think it probably could have been a way to get up there, but... These big coins are dragon coins. Pick up five of them in this in one level and you get a one up. Classic Mario World. And I bet you nine times out of ten I'm probably not gonna be getting all of them. I'll take it. Not bad, not bad for a first start. Did lose one power up, but got pretty much got back in the end. Frozen Crystal Cave. Alright. I see. It's one of these levels. I 
I don't. I was, I was wondering like I was wondering like what the deal was. Couldn't really get past. God damn it. Remember Rumble, there's it's it's slippery physics. <sighs> Think like I could to go back to the previous world and get some power ups. That's one thing. I, uh, that's the one thing I kind of like about Mario World. If you like, you know, if you beat if you beat the level, and uh, you know, you, and you know, like some places where power ups are, then you be able to uh, go back and you know get a power up or two. This is obviously an interesting start now, isn't it? And one more for good measure. I, I hate I hate slippery ice physics. Okay, get main power up there. And then go here. We're off to a great start, aren't we? Go lose my, go lose all my fucking lives on the second, on the second level. And bet MJ is that swell. That's almost, that's kind of embarrassing. Barely made any progress on the first, on, on the first attempt. <sighs> I 
I I hate the fact that like it has fucking ice. I hate the fact that there's fucking ice physics. to keep that but whatever. Yes I know about the dragon coins. I could be able to go back into this into this uh, level and get a power up for the next for the next section. And I know I'm gonna back up when I start the next level. Too close for comfort. God damn it! It didn't jump! Are you kidding me? Yeah. I finally got a checkpoint. You Mario God damn it. I 
And go for checkpoints. I got a one up at least. Nice! Finally got by that level. Now, again I'm gonna go back to the first world, you know, the mushroom power out for safekeeping. Finally, I got past the second level. Now we're going to the top, apparently. <coughs> that must be a new. That must be a new enemy, because I don't think I've ever seen that before in classic, you know, Mario World. Okay, so those things can be can be taken out. Okay. Well now I'll learn something new. Apparently they can like they can push you back. I'm in an interesting predicament now, aren't I? <sighs> are these are going to seriously be my roadblocks? Like every single time, like every single time I somehow manage to take one out, I get pushed off screen. I get pushed off screen far enough to where it's like, oh. Or it's like, oh, it's going to respawn regardless. Really?
God, I hate when that shit happens. so annoying. But at least I'm making at least I'm making a little bit more progress than you know before. I could have I could have had one out. So it's like I could have had one up if I didn't get blown away by Mr. by Mr. Bloody McCloud ass. Now we can continue on. Bumpy Highlands. Another new enemy, perhaps? Yeah, you definitely can't, can't seem to kill him. Seriously, just take a plunge. I can't believe that shit. Maybe there's gonna be like a secret exit or something, but 
I guess I can, I guess I couldn't be I guess I guess I'm not too surprised because I think like um you know the, th the thing was in yellow so what's the next level frozen forest well I'm not gonna do that just yet I'm gonna go back and get me some some power-ups. Wait, that's... That's too far! This is gonna be like one of the. I wonder if this is gonna be like another Forest of Illusions kind of thing. Danger! The forest is so cold that everything freezes. In me. In, in, I don't know what the fuck that says. I'll definitely take I'll definitely take a nice little cake power up. Oh. <sighs> okay, so apparently in this level because of how because of how dangerously cold it is for pretty much everything if if you get touched by something if you get touched by something it's instant death no matter how, no matter what power up you have that kind of sucks but I bet like that kind of sucks but at least I now know how I did it again I was about to say, that kind of sucks, but at least, yeah, at least I'm a little bit more aware now. I saw something. Okay, that was weird. Okay, so I got a key. And an exit! Where do you lead? Oh, Blue Switch Palace. Ba 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 ba!
Uh, so these are basically just coins. The power of the switch you push will turn oh, will turn blocks into those. Your progress will also be saved. Forest Ghost House. Well, even though it said, even, well, even though it, it did say or whatever, but I went to like a little backup, random backup save. Okay, so those those do not hurt you. Those are just like you know some decorative light things. God damn it. Okay, so we got another uh, another door, or another lock thing that needs a key. Question is, where is it? Oh, that's 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 an actual door. I, I I don't I don't know if you guys thought the same thought the same thing I did, but I thought like I kind I kind of had like a random ass thought that that was like um like a like a wood piece for the background or something like that, or just something that wasn't really a door. But hey, I mean, you know, I am, I am learning, slow but surely learning. Okay, so apparently I got a piece switch. Oh, wait a minute. Is this something I'm supposed to like... Um, is, is this something I'm supposed to like grab from the start and go back here and... There should be like uh, something like over here, like a hidden P switch door or something. <sighs> oh wait. 
I forgot that's, that's where I say where I had then go to the door. I did not think that, that was going to be a falling platform, or falling, uh, I did not know that section was going to be missing, that's what I was trying to say. Hopefully, 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 you guys are enjoying the uh, stream so far. I know, I, only, I know, I only got one person in the chat right now, although you know they're not talking, which I suppose is fine. Oh, damn it, I'm, I'm doing it again. But yeah, ho ho hopefully, whoever's in the chat, you know, hopefully, hopefully, you are enjoying the stream so far. Even if you aren't, um, you know, talking at all. Almost. Man, I suppose that wasn't too bad. You know, it, was, it was not a long one, but it was just something that you, uh, you know, had, had to look at, had to look, you know, pay attention to. Number one, boom boom. Is that is that a hint towards the boss? Are, are we gonna fa are, are we gonna be facing Boom Boom in this uh, in this level? Okay, so apparently those were, uh, those were, those were spikes. <laughs> no, I don't think I want to do it from there.
All you need to do is chill out. <laughs> well, first off, hey Onyx. Welcome to my stream. How you been doing today? Hopefully you be doing the well, good sir. Tis nice to see you. Yeah, just playing me a uh, Christmas themed Mario World ROM hack that I found that I've had for um, I've have, I've had this for quite a while, but I never really did much with it. Outside my apartment door, I got a mini fridge to go with my old mini fridge. Got, well, I got the freezer. <laughs> nice! That sounds pretty nice! Frozen. I was frozen today. Right. She's quite so, yes. <sighs> yeah, I've had to deal with some slippery ice physics on some of these levels for the time being. Me too. Onyx man with the zingers. Ah. 
back. I could have had another power up if I didn't fucking hit the damn those damn spike things. Let me go. Ah, checkpoint finally. Let me in the door. Really? level and I'm gonna get I'm gonna get stock up on the mushrooms I'm just I'm just lucky enough that I had a fucking continue thing and I didn't have to do all that shit again quite something to say at the very least when it comes to this hack so far. <sighs> I don't really know how long this hack is either, like, I, I, since I have, I've had it for so long, I, I didn't really look at any information as to how, how many worlds and levels and stuff there were. So I am probably going to be doing this quite a bit. Are you serious? Fucking hell. Fucking damn it. <sighs> okay. Okay, so at least we know what the boss is and what's gonna be the little obstacle, which is basically that 
I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know if it's like an, an enemy that was unused in the game, but I, I'm still gonna think that um, that penguin thing is probably something that's made for that was made for this hack. Ow. I don't think I'm bitch! <sighs> boom Boom from Castle Number One is now just a, there's now just a memory. Mario's making progress on his adventure. But the final castle is still very far away. Okay. Damn. Can't couldn't better go back to uh Well, I mean if you think well I mean if you think about it, you know a penguin that just basically pushes you around is is begging for is begging is begging for it. But anyway. Danger, the water is very cold. You can only survive in the water for a short amount of time. <laughs> the penguin from 64 was terrible. Eh. I'm, I, I almost kind of assume you're probably talking about that racing one. Okay, so those things can't hurt you. Noted. Anno annoyingly noted. Pipe is spawning those things. Interesting. Thank you, Onyx. Much appreciated. 
Yeah, Shadow, ha yeah, Shadow hasn't been around my streams as much, so... I can't, so I, I, as I said, as I kind of said, uh, last night and such, I've been without a mod for at least, you know, a time or two. I mean, the only good, I mean, the only good thing is that, like, you know, nothing, nothing is, nothing bad has happened, you know, in those times, but it's just, you know, it's just a lack of mods is all. I basically just have, like, you know, one or two people. Yeah, that that is true. I can't I can't disagree with that. Ancient temple. It's almost it's kinda of funny it's kinda of funny to hear that theme when you're not inside like a haunted castle or something. So, so the bathroom. You is confusing me. Are you talking? Are you talking about like the uh, the, the the name of the level in a way? And their little checkpoint system thing. That ah, shit. Okay, so apparently those are um, breakable. Could you not fire your shit, whatever you call it? Surely make some progress. Snowball madness, oh goody. Oh goody. Wait, what are you gonna say? Danger in falling snowballs and snow snow ninjas which which can bear which can can barely see. Be careful.
Uh. Well then. Try, trying to deal with that shit and all of a sudden it's like I just... <laughs> yeah, those are some big walls. Probably wreck your ass in a heartbeat. I got a white mush. Okay. For the clip on the up. Okay, so I guess we're in world two. Oh my. Feel free to take a break here in my in my second house. You're always welcome, my friend. Here she. Well, I'll definitely uh, do just that. Hold on. I'll definitely do just that. Take a nice little break. Hmm. I did some research for you. The Ice Princess is, the, the Ice Princess is called Undyne. She can freeze water immediately, so do not touch it. Undyne. I think I know two characters called Undyne, like um one is from Undertale. Another one I think is like I got I, I wanna say like I I, I, I wanna say that the other one Yeah, yeah, I know I know that on nine. Like I know I know that one and this one's spelled differently, but it's like I I'm, I'm trying to remember like there was a, about another undying. Like like part of me part of me wants to think that it's from like um Adventure Time, but I think it's that's actually called the Ice Queen because you know Ice King, Ice Queen, a lot. But I, I don't know. But it's 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 got some it's it's got some it's got some familiarity in terms of the name. <sighs> Wonderful sunset. Well, at least I at least I know that I could be able to. Uh, Come to Yoshi's second house to build get some power up. Oh, everything is black. That's a good question. Hmm. 
Uh, that's, the, that's the pink one. Whee! Okay, that's a flying penguin. Okay, can't, can't go down that one. Okay, so yeah, I definitely gotta be careful here because everything is everything is in black, which means I can hardly see shit. So I gotta pay attention to like the foreshadowings and the backgrounds and the whatnot. But you know, <sighs> at least I'm at least I'm getting the hang of it. Everything's so dark, I can't even see my own stats. <laughs> Ice King Spiny. Before we do that, let's uh minecart racing. Touch these crystals, they will hurt you. Make sure that you do not touch the wall. Ow. Okay, so I guess those are the crystals. Okay, so uh, this is gonna this is gonna be a thing. God damn it! Shit, <laughs> use the floors. I think this is probably going to be another my, my newest roadblock so far. farther that time
I supposed to get up there? Yeah, I I had a feeling, but like, you know, it it seems like by the time I try and do that, it's already too late. See, like I can't like I can't be able to do it in time. Cause it's either like, you know, a, it's gonna, I'm gonna overshoot it, or B, I wanna die from, like, falling down below or something. Fire flower, you cannot shoot it. Ow, ow. Okay, so yeah, that definitely is insta death. <sighs> yeah, that's pretty much all that I can do. I'm just trying to figure out the whole situation how, how I'm supposed to get up, to, up, up top if, like, um, you know. I do think that the cart is kind of funny though. The, the design of it, uh, I mean. I. Mm. I don't. I. I don't know. It's like I. It's like I, I I barely just like hit the edge and all of a sudden it's like I I died. I I guess I guess apparently you know I I have to make sure that I'm in the cart and if it's if it if it can't reach something then it pretty much I guess is like an instant death. Okay, well I hit it, but I didn't get enough oomph from it. The fuck game. Take a random chance, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna save it here. So 
So I'll have to do some of that stuff again. Fuck! There we go. Ah, I finally got past that park. Thank fuck. Okay. Thank you. I'm happy I managed to get by that. Finally got through it. <sighs> Destroyed village. Yeah, finally got through that part. Those are sweating. <laughs> wow. A pony joke, huh? Alright, I'll uh, I'll roll with it. Yeah, we got another scroller up in here. Would you believe that I? Would you believe me if I told you that my original Pony OC was kind of like was kind of like based around making a Duke Nukem a five pony? Like I, I I don't know if I ever showed you my Pony OC that I actually made. Quit chucking your balls in my face. Let's see what was in that thing.
take that. <sighs> Red Switch Palace. Well, before I do anything, I want to stock up on I want to stock up some power ups. I've actually, yeah, um, I actually kind of tried to make an attempt at one point of doing so, something like a Duke Nukem type pony character. Um, a friend of mine who, uh, is, who is also one of my followers here on, on uh, here on Twitch, um, he actually took like some concept ideas that I had, and he actually kind of made, I guess you could say, a little bit of edit, editing or two, and. Yeah, you know, basic. But basically, now I have like my own little Pony OC character. Yeah, yeah, I, I kind of like it. Yeah, it's, it's um, I I, I will say I, I will say like um my Pony character, my Pony OC is a Pegasus character. Um, I got like, I got a uh, I got like a red body. And like my my neck and to to, um, to the top of my head is kind of like you know the, the hu kind of human skin color. Um, sometimes I do my pony does wear uh, shades, and uh, I do have like some markings that are kind of like blue and black to kind of like represent the uh, the pants and uh, Duke shoes, and and I do have a uh, it's pretty much called a cutie mark, which basically is like the ponyfied you know, mark of a, of a pony, and it kind of has, like, a, um, it, it kind of has, like, a, uh, it, it, it's, it's kind of like the, it's kind of like a nuke symbol in a way, with, with, like, a rose thing on it, and all that stuff, it's, it, I like, I like it, it's, there's no bad soil. Anyway, let's see what Red Switch Palace is. Switch your push will turn those blocks and the solid ones. Your progress will also be saved. Alright. Ice King Ice Spiny. save for the hell it. Oh, I got a, a feather.
Oh. I see. Fuck. I, I was wondering, like, how, how I was wondering, like, how am I supposed to, uh, Vanilla Ice's castle? Well, if this is Vanilla Ice's castle, you sure, you must, you must sure be a big fan of, uh, Bowser. To have, like, you know, those little, uh, mini fire turn things. Fuck! I am not gonna go that far without my stuff. Not, not really. I don't, I don't really like follow or you know want to see much of anything with the uh, vanilla eyes. Show sale for my stream. I, I gotta admit that was that was pretty funny. That if if only if only that was clipped.
Ow. Welcome back. Pretty much just in time for me to face fucking fiery ice spiny looking thing. But you, you also you also missed a little so you also missed something that was worth a clippable moment, but um I, I don't know I don't know what it was, but like there, there's like this little Bowser looking like uh, um there was like a mini looking Bowser thing that was just like jumping all over the place. And um it got it something happened to it where it's like well one of those little wall spike things like came down and when it came on right on top of it, it's made brrrr, right, up, right upwards, and it, it was kind of funny. God damn it. Fuck. Ugh. That thing that's that, th that block thing got destroyed so fucking fast. God damn it! Ah, oh, fucking spitting hot fire like you're trying to rap, like it's trying to rap or something. Well, I will say, like, if this is Vanilla Ice's castle, I guess we found his pet. Fucking spiny ass, some bitch. Fuck! And you just had to throw the fucking time timer limit on me, didn't you? Well, I'm still trying to figure out this fucking boss. Thank you for that clip. <sighs> Much real appreciated. God damn it! Are you serious? Oh my gosh, is this boss ever annoying?
Are you kidding me? Mario, go in the fucking door, you son of a bitch. God damn it. <sighs> oh my god, could you fucking have a pattern on your ass? is boss. <sighs> Firing all cylinders apparently. G Mario! Go in the fucking door! Is it though? Is it? I think it'll be more okay if I can somehow get past this fucking boss. God that, that uh, I hope to God that that fucking cow that has to hit.
Thank fuck. I will take I will take that. I had a feeling you were gonna clip it, but thank you nonetheless. <sighs> Mario has defeated the King Ice Spine in Castle 2. All that is left is Sundine's castle while she prepares for her big attack to steal all the presents. And thank you. Thank you. So let's see. Let's have the Dundines cancel, so maybe this might be a final world. Hmm. <sighs> Climbing the trees. Yeah, I guess I wasn't kidding. That was a funny little uh, exit thing. Thank you. Okay, yeah, so I guess maybe it's about like two worlds, maybe three at the very least, I don't know. I panicked a little bit. Hey, what a panic moon!
We don't, we, we don't need your fiery farts today. So, so I guess we have, so I guess we have like maybe two or three levels left before we get to, before we complete this hack. Mmm. <sighs> oh. But hopefully everyone is enjoying the stream so far. I mean, I I will say I will say this like, you know, like despite the death and stuff that I've had, I mean, this, de this definitely has been a nice little hack to play, um, you know, I'm, I'm definitely having some, you know, some enjoyment, despite all the, uh, the rage and all that stuff that happens at times. Mr. Spoiny. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. It's not fair, man! So close to the end, all of a sudden, something fucking just like... Just comes up from underneath me and gives me a case of fuck my... Taking your shell as payment. <sighs> God damn it. I think there's at least a star ode. I don't know if we're going to be able to get to that. Please tell me that happens only once. Nice. Very nice.
Ah, victory road. What's this? Oh, look at that. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get the coins. Thank you. For I'm gonna say I'm 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 gonna assume it's probably gonna say like thank you for playing or something. Thank you for playing. Yep. Thank you for playing, Mary. Christmas. Isn't isn't that nice? That's that's pretty cool. Yeah, just you know, not not nothing really in terms of like a big thing. It's you know, just a little something that says Merry Christmas. One, two. Beep. That was weird. <laughs> Okay, so maybe there's like another Star Road thing somewhere. I don't know. <coughs> but that was a nice little bonus, though. I will admit. Ooh. Back door. Hmm. Let's see what the back door has to offer. I can't hardly see shit. Back door of this, if it actually takes, if there's like another direction, direct pathway to the bush. Do you believe in Santa? It does not matter actually. I will freeze you to death. You will never win. Is that right? <laughs> oh, thank you.
this must be I get I I'm gonna assume this is like a Sinis remix of the Big Horns boss. Which which that's which that's pretty cool in my opinion. The fact that that the fact that they're actually using like a phonic theme for a boss is interesting. Ow. Okay, what the <laughs> am I supposed to do? Trying to think, like, what, if there's any, if there's something that I'm missing. God damn it. God damn it. Fucking wave. Why can you pick it up, Mario? God damn it! I'd like to have my power-ups, at least. 
At least I have like the fucking cape or something. Really? Oh my god. Okay, so at least I have a little bit of understanding as to how sh how this how uh, this undying boss works. I, the one thing I just, just kind of don't know is, um, it's like you know how, what are, what are the odds of like she's gonna be able to, you know, summon a fucking ice ice block thing that doesn't break on contact. One hit off. I don't know if that counted or not. Did you check it that way? Are you fucking serious? Oh. 
Oh my gosh. My my thing missed, and all of a sudden it's like here just go. <sighs> Please tell me that counts as a second hit. Damn it! Check another cube. Come on, you bitch. Check another cube. I dare you. Damn it, Mario! Why well, once you pick up the first time, you don't do it, and then when I least expect you to, you pick it up and you just. Ah! About like what three hits now at least. <sighs> God damn it. Mario, 
Pick up the fucking ice cube. Damn it. <clears throat> oh my god, if I didn't go that far, I probably would have gotten another hit. Damn it. Let me get my thing. Thank you. If you can clip that, that'd be much appreciated. Mario has finally defeated Undyne. Now Mario, Luigi, Yoshi, the princess, and their friends can celebrate Christmas. Oh my word. Game design made by Nyalzi. I will say, like, that was, that, that was, uh, that was a heck of a little. That was a heck of a boss battle. I mean, definitely, definitely have make it make you be on the edge of your she, uh, edge of your seat. But I'm glad I managed to actually beat this. But I'm I'm glad that I managed to beat this on stream, and no issues occurred. But you know, besides the whole dying situation. SMW Central. Yeah, I will, I will say like that was that was that was that was definitely a nice uh, ROM hack to play. You know, it had its own little uh, you know thing going for it. Playing this on this feedback would be nice. Thank you. Thank you for that clip. -o. And Merry Christmas. Very nice. There's all the eggs. Three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'm gonna go in. Oh, the, I was gonna go in and leave it, leave it on this thing. Oh, but yeah, that that was definitely pretty cool. Um, I mean, again, d despite all the deaths and stuff that I've had, I mean, I I I, I liked it. You know, it was. It was it was not too bad of it was not too bad of a uh, ROM hack to play and you know I, I had me some I had me some fun with it and again that 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 I, that, that final boss battle though like 
Oh man, it definitely uh, puts you on the edge of your seat, you know, from like the fucking, you know, like the wave, just seeing like pushing it back and forth and all that shit. To never knowing exactly as to when, you know, I'm dying is gonna like have a nice have a nice key that's gonna not break, and so we could be able to you know use it and you know add her and whatnot. <sighs> but yeah. So that was my playthrough of Super Mario World Christmas. I hope everyone has enjoyed. Um, I'm going to do my schedule and then my outro and then I'm going to try and raid someone. So, you know, as always, please stay tuned for that. But, uh, yeah, this was the second day of my slow week for this week where I decided to play some Super Mario World doing a Christmas edition ROM hack. I hope everyone has enjoyed. Um... My next stream is going to be on Monday, as part of my active week of streaming. And I'm either going to do A, uh, Sonic V Air DA Garden Edition with Sally Acorn and Amy Rose, or I might do, um, <laughs> or I might do, um, the, the Sega Master System PC remake of Sonic 1, uh, doing like a, like a super playthrough was like maybe one or two characters depending on how things go as far as time um so, so it's gonna be some Sonic related at least on, on Monday and then on Tuesday will be another installment of Among Us um I'm, I'm going to try and play some around uh, I'm going to try and play the, some more modded game modes um there was this one that got recently done I think called Christmas which basically was like it's kind of like it's kind of like zombie modes, but instead of having like you know one zombie or something like that, you basically it's basically decked out in the theme of Christmas. So it's like um, so it's like pretty much it's pretty much like a game of tag involving reindeer, elves, and someone being Santa. So that so hope so maybe I so so I might you know try that out on stream and. Uh, if anyone has a game and knows about the how to, you know, play with the scale.net mod stuff, uh, then you guys can be able to join me for that. Or maybe if I get enough people, I may do my own little modded session thing, or I may just do like a regular version of Among Us. I mean, I don't know. It's, you yeah, know, but Among Us is definitely going to be something that I'm, I'm going to be trying to do <laughs> on, um, on Tuesday. And then, of course, I'm off Wednesday and Thursday. And then Friday, I'm going to be doing another Mario World ROM hack that I found. Um, I believe it's called Mario Saves Christmas. So, you know, we're going to probably check that out. And then Saturday will be another installment of Second Sonic Saturday. Where I'm going to be going back into the Sonic the Hedgehog Frenzy hack from the Sonic Hacking Contest of 2020. Um, I believe I have everything fixed to where I can build a quick save. Uh, at any time because I couldn't be able to do that in my first playthrough so hopefully if we can be able to make some progress I can be able to save my progress and you know continue on with the hack and everything and then uh, my next stream after Saturday will be on Sunday and I think I might try and do more of uh, Keen Dreams and I'm going to try and see how I'm, I'm going to try my luck and see how things will go with the hard mode because even though I did finish the game um, uh, recently, I, I did finish the normal playthrough, but I, was, I just wasn't I just, I just wasn't quite ready to try on the hard mode difficulty thing just yet, so you know, that's going to be a thing. <coughs> but until, uh, until that time and stuff though, if you enjoy what you saw today and you're watching this on Twitch, Give the channel a follow and become a Romo Maniac today. If you want to help me out just a little bit more, feel free to help spread my channel around and help and help me get to that affiliate status goal, which currently I only have one goal left to achieve. And that is having an average of three viewers or more for my streams. So your viewership is highly appreciated and your follows are more than welcome. I hope I'm able to, I hope I am able to entertain you guys in some sort of way with what I do because I try and do what I can with what I got, but also I like to build, I like to build a play thing because of what I enjoy as well. From like uh, shooters, classic games, mods, ROM hacks, and stuff like that. But I, I try to be I try to be a variety kind of guy here and there. Um, I do have a current goal on my Twitch, which is 
if I somehow reach affiliate, then the first affiliate stream that I will do will be me attempting to play through the OG registered version of Doom, meaning it's going to be the non-ultimate version of Doom, where I will play all three episodes with a mod called with the mod called Dusk. If those of you who don't know, uh, Dusk is a mod that basically is bringing the weapons and some gameplay elements from the game Dusk into Doom. It's something, uh, it's something that I've actually been playing around with quite a lot here on the channel. And that will do what is called the Intruder Mode, which is basically the equivalent of pistol starting each level, so I'll have nothing more than my pistol and sickles to deal with, that to use for my main attacks, and I have to just go with what the, uh, the levels provide and stuff like that. And because the mod has gotten updated, uh, to include the enemies from Dusk, I'll even try and attempt to do a pistol start slash intruder mode run with the Dusk enemies. So, if you guys want to see me kind of, you know, pistol start Doom in some sort of way with, you know, some weapons and, you know, new kind of enemy types that stuff to deal with, then, yeah, again, help me, then help me get to that goal of affiliate. You know, it'd be, it'd be much appreciated. Um, if you have a Twitter account, you can follow me at Mr. Rumble Roses. To know what goes on from things that I post on my YouTube channel to um, any updates to my streams if I post something about my streams to just having some sort of way to um, you know keep in touch with me whether it be like a tweet or a DM or something like that and finally if you have a, if, if you're watching this on YouTube whenever it gets published and I know it's gonna be a little while but uh, if you're watching this on YouTube as always you know feel free to get a channel a sub which is just like following here on Twitch. Give the video a like. Leave a nice comment down below. As well as hitting the bell notification. So that way you guys never miss an upload from me. Whether it's something I do exclusively for YouTube. Or if it's a past stream I've done here on Twitch. <sighs> but yeah. Um, I am, again I am going to try and raid someone. I don't know who I'm going to raid just yet. But until I see everyone know. In the next video or live stream. Take care everybody.